Hey Earth Science and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your December 19th, 2018 love reading. Oh my goodness, my ears just started ringing big time. Okay, <laughs> this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Oops. All right, your first card out is the Two of Pentacles in reverse, the Four of Pentacles in reverse, and the Six of Swords. The person you are dealing with. These are signs dealing with the Ace of Cups in reverse, the Six of Wands, the Seven of Pentacles. Your guys' outcome for the day is the Magician. The Knight of Pentacles in reverse. And the Five of Pentacles in reverse. I will take the Fool too because I pulled that out as well. Your guys' bottom of the deck and shared energy is the Knight of Cups. Clarified by the Page of Swords and the Tower. Okay. So, um, Earth Signs. You guys um, are no longer... Wanting to put in the effort it takes to um, juggle too many things. It's time to put one thing down. And this doesn't even necessarily have to mean like a third party or juggling two people. This could be um, you have a 9 to 5, 40 hour a week job, but you're trying to get your own business on the side up and going. Or, you know, you're trying to put 60 hours in at work, but coach the little league team at night or something like that. It's somewhere where you are juggling your energy between two different things that are taking up your time. And you're not then able to invest in either one um, fully. So you're just kind of, um, you just got too many things going on right now. And you are deciding to put um, down some one of them to be able to concentrate on the other. Um, your next card out is the four of pentacles in reverse. So, um, you were trying to, um, do too many things at once to try to save up money, to try to, um, kind of have a little stockpile going on the side. Um, but you're deciding that it's, it's just wearing you out. It's, you're doing too much and it's exhausting you and you're not able to fully commit to one thing. That's on one side of it. The other side is if you have two people, um, you're no longer wanting to uh, keep putting in energy and keep putting in work into both relationships when you know that there's only one that you truly want. Um, you've been trying to stockpile money on the side as well in order to be able to move forward um, on to out of this relationship that no longer serves you and into something that is more fulfilling um, emotionally, uh, spiritually, uh, just everything. So um, for some of you, if this is like work related, you are uh, focusing just on one job. You are leaving one that um, is not financially satisfying you and moving into something else. If this is a relationship, you are no longer having a third party you are deciding which one you want to invest your time and love into. And you are moving away from a rough time in your life and moving into smoother waters. Um, you're following a path that nobody wanted you to take, but you are finally taking the path that you want instead of doing what everybody else wants you to do. That's important for somebody. The person you are dealing with, um, they feel like, this just hasn't been able to get off the ground. They've wanted a new beginning with you. They wanted to invest with you emotionally. They have a lot of love for you, but right now they're drained by the whole situation. They're drained waiting for you to put down one of these pinnacles and focus on them. Um, they're, they're finding much success in other areas of their life. They could be very popular. Um, they could be like known in the media. They could be known... Um, like on a social network, they could have lots of friends, whatever it is that they're doing. They're very popular. They have a lot of eyes on them right now and they're looking fabulous, but behind the scenes, they are watering their own garden. They are 
um, planning their seeds of intention. They're planning their future and they are just going to wait for everything to blossom in its due time. This person is being very patient and I feel that they are no longer waiting for you to leave that other person. They're just moving on with their life, focusing on their work, their career, focusing on um, just growing into the person that they want to be, growing into the job that they want to create, the career they want to create, and they're no longer focusing on love as much as they once had been. Um, your guys' is bottom of the deck. Um, with all this mixed energy, you are going to make a love offer to somebody or somebody is to you. Uh, you are taking your life by the reins. You are no longer um, just doing the normal thing. You see that one cup in his hand. He is coming forward to make that. Um, after the experience, shake, something shakes this person up. Um, there, A shakeup is needed, though, in order for this person to move into your life or you into someone else's life. Somebody from a distance could have been keeping an eye on you, could have been watching you, but they're no longer doing that because, like I said, they're moving on with their own life, focusing on their own goals and watering their own garden, planting their own seeds of intention. And that's enough to shake you up and make you worried that this person is moving away from you. So um, after this tower, after realizing that this person is no longer um, pressuring you to drop this other pentacle, um, you're realizing you have to drop that other pentacle in order to offer this to the person that you truly want to be with. Your guys' outcome cards for the day. You are going to be able to manifest the situation, the relationship, the outcome that you want if you properly use the tools the universe has entrusted you to have and given you after you have learned all these lessons along the road. So you do have the power to use this shakeup, this um, tower moment as you see the, the lightning bolt and then he's got a lightning bolt above his head. You have the tools learned from this tower moment to manifest the relationship into uh, the level you want it to be. You're no longer feeling like um, you don't have enough to offer this person because that was never the case. Um, you do have enough. You are enough. They don't want your pinnacles. They want your time, your love, your attention. And um, when they felt they weren't getting that from you, they decided to go out and get it um, other places. And I don't say this person is cheating on you. That's not it at all. This is in the form of a career and friends. Um, and they know that if this is meant to be, you will be back. They are just planting their seeds of intention and, and allowing in their life, whoever it is that is meant to come into their life. So if you want that to be you or signs, you have that power right now. So um, leave that thought that you're not enough at the door because it's not the case here. Also, this is somebody you're returning to that you have left in the past. You or sign left this person in the past. So you're a little worried about coming back towards them because you know you hurt them. You know that um, you didn't end things right in the, the last time. So you are a little hesitant don't worry about that. This person has healed from that. This person is looking fabulous. Um, so don't take this at a snail's pace because they're no longer waiting. They will move on if you don't move forward. Um, you guys have been stuck in the past, but I don't see that any longer um, because you guys have finally figured it out. Um, I do see you making a love offer and taking a leap of faith with somebody that you have been with in the past, um, but you are coming back and making a love offer um, wanting this person to take that leap of faith with you, um, to take that jump. And it's going to, uh, be a very lighthearted, um, energy because in the past, this was very heavy, a very heavy relationship, but they have to see that you're actually serious this time. Yeah. And it's time to have a heart to heart conversation with them and truly and honestly discuss your feelings for each other because there's, there's love here on both sides of this, but the past has drained this person. So it's time to express how you truly feel and let them know that you are serious this time, that you really do um, want to find success in a future with this person. So, all right, Earth Signs, I hope you have a beautiful Wednesday. I'll see you tomorrow and God bless.